Hey guys, um, here's a new video. This is um, a hybrid by Uwe Kahle. Grüner Orange um, X Flying Saucer. Both in brackets, both are one plant. And cross with Macola. The number is KA 13 224 15. So KA 13 224 15. So this is the flower. I'm giving you a nice little little video, little tour. Petals are very at the sepals are very nicely. Petals have a nice flower. This is um it's it's almost certainly uh has something to do with the world it's too. Um we're measuring measuring it now. Gotta be careful that my dog doesn't run away again. He's such a gangster. Well, sixteen point five centimeters in diameter. That's a nice. That's a nice size for a flower. About sixteen centimeters tall. Just had to catch my dog. He's been, he's been no Snoopy. He's licking the pot. The neighbor is making sounds, and he's not, he's not a fan of it. Na neighbor is making like, he's cutting the, the brushes and stuff like this, you know. And he hates that when other people do something. He feels like he's the only one that's allowed to do something. Can't blame him though. Life must be easy when you're a beagle. All right, now we're pollinating. What, what I'm doing first is I collect some pollen and showing you the Snoopy again. He's very, he's very annoyed by the by the sounds coming from the neighbor. Oh, sorry Snoopy, I can't I can't tell him to not cut his own brushes. Plant is too too tall to um to put it sideways and uh brush the pollen into my bag. But I'm I'm cutting it away and that gives me a little bit of pollen to work with it's enough you know I don't need a lot in between my uh, all steps everything that I do I always disinfect all the tools as we speak I have like five five brushes in my uh, disinfectant Snoopy is gone again. Wait a second, I need to find him. Found him. There he is. Have a look. There he is. The Snoopy. Ah, oh, I gotta bring him inside very soon because it's too hot for him. It's very early, but still very hot, but already very hot. Snoopus Maximus Gladiator Beagle It's not a bad flower um, It has potential You know if you bring in more yellow into this into this sky you might have a, a great a great cross there, you know Snoopy, I'll bring you inside very soon. Let me just finish this cross and uh, then we're going inside.
All right, I think this is enough. <coughs> Need to write my label, otherwise it's uh, it's totally chaotic with everything you do. <sighs> the, the, the the pencil doesn't write very well. I need I really need something to write on here. All right, now I'm uh, bringing Snoopy inside and think think about the potential father for this cross in the meantime. All right, um, I decided I will use Trichocerus paranoi. Um, I'm a big fan of them, but um, they are not always great parents, you know. In regards to the body, they're amazing. But, uh, you know, they are all white. There aren't many uh, hybrids with Trichocerois Pachanoi that have colored flowers. I'm, I'm getting started with, with, some, with some other breeders who did a lot of, of work in this field, you know, like Misplant. Misplant did an did a immense number of crosses with, uh, with Trichocerois Pachanoi and, and similar relatives, and they are all amazing. I'm a big fan of his work. Um, yeah, and uh, it's still very early, you know, it's still in the beginning. So yeah, this cross is Grüner Orange crossed with Flying Saucer as, as mother and uh, Makola as father. And I'm using Trichocerus Paranoi now. I do a Trichoteros Paranoi cross every now and then, you know, just to just to keep it fresh, just to get a few cool plants to work with. And uh, I usually do it when there's potential, you know, when I see potential. But um, but yeah, um, in this case, there's a lot of potential because the flower is already good, and uh, with a nice Paranoi body, this would be awesome. This could be excellent, you know. So this is almost the last cross of the morning. I think I have one more to go. So there will be more videos very soon. Bye.